All right, guys, so we are back with another video, but this is gonna be a little bit different, and I'm gonna start doing some different videos. Um, portion of this is gonna be showing off a house, and the other portion is gonna be talking about um, some stuff you need to know as a home buyer. So first off, I wanted to take just a moment to show off this fantastic kitchen. This um, home you have seen before, but I wanted to point out a couple of details that you may or may not have noticed in the last video. So we do have a tile backsplash that runs all the way to the ceiling. And it also runs from the bottom of the cabinet, or sorry, the base cabinet to the top cabinet. Now, with that being said, so as you see here, it goes all the way up, all the way down. With that being said, what that does is that helps you, the homeowner, keep clean walls. It makes it really easy if, say you're cooking on this beautiful flat top stove and you spill something. Well, it's not gonna dry into the wall. It is gonna land right on this tile and it makes it super easy to clean up. We have these beautiful high definition cabinets. I call them high definition cabinets. That's just my made up own word. But either way, beautiful gray cabinets. Um, of course, if you wanted a different color, you could get it. We have shelves in here. But one of the cool things is the appliance package in this home. We do have a beautiful built-in stainless steel microwave here, as you can see. We also have a really good size oven as well. Stainless steel. Frigidaire appliances, really, really good. Now, um, this house comes with a stainless steel farmhouse sink. Some people love it, some people hate it. You can change it out to whatever you like. And also guys, if you wanted to do black appliances, you totally could in this home as well. And that would honestly look good as well. Now, a couple of things I probably didn't point out before was these two huge drawers here and also you have identical drawers on the island as well. Now let's take a peek at these. Look how big, I'm gonna try to pan down here. Look how big that drawer is guys. It is massive. It's meant for pots and pans of course, but it really, really adds some storage for you guys. Now we do have here a outlet and this one on this side as well of the island now that makes entertaining very very easy and as you can see there's four drawers on each side too now <clears throat> i don't know if i pointed this out in the other video but we have a full-blown pantry here in the kitchen as well now this is on our kinston lot it is our terminator home and it is probably one of the most popular out of all the homes that we have seen here in Kinston. Now, I'm gonna cut and I'm gonna take you to the master bathroom and we'll go over some of the details there. Look at this bathroom, guys. Let me cut off that fan because that's kind of annoying. All right, so look at this. I call it the Charleston style bathroom because of those shutters, but it is just fantastic we've got a ton of uh, light coming in i had to cut that fan off so then a little bit of the light but we have the dual vanity sinks just excuse me in the mirror there we have oh i went up we have the dual vanity square porcelain sinks in this home and this is a double wide guys we have come a long way from <laughs> the trailer days of old we do have these beautiful um mirrors that come from the factory and that is in this bathroom as well. Also, also a linen closet on either side of the sink. So his and hers linen closet as well. Now, as we turn around, we have this massive, massive tub with shelving on either side. Now guys, some people love tubs, some people don't. But if you don't love the tub, then we could obviously take it out and we could do something a little different there. I love this little extra storage cabinet here right in front of the shower. And look at this. 
these open. Don't know why you would want them open, but you can open them and look at that shower, guys. Look at that. That beautiful Amazon rain head shower, and we have the transom window, and we also have that beautiful tile glass right there, and it wraps around the whole entire shower. Now, over there, as you can see, we have a water closet. Some people love that, some people hate it. So it just depends. You could change pretty much anything in most of our houses. Um, we are kind of a design center. We would love to help you design your custom home, even it be a double wide, single wide, or pretty much anything. We carry probably one of the largest selections in Eastern North, you know what, I'm gonna go ahead and say it. We carry the largest selection in Eastern North Carolina. We have a ton of homes at all five of our dealerships. So we really, really can help you find your dream home. Uh, and we can give it to you the best price as well. So just wanted to show off this master bath. Oh crap, there's me in the corner again. <laughs> All right, guys. So I told you this video is going to be a little bit different. I wanted to actually just stand and talk with you guys a little bit about the process of home buying and what can you expect whenever you start the purchase of your brand new home. So hold on one second. All right, guys. So today I wanted to talk to you a little bit about land and how we go about helping you find the piece of property perfect for your mobile home or modular home, or if you already have it, how we can help you in that. So we'll start off first with um, if you already own land. Of course, if you already own land, you know you're ahead of the curve. It's a fantastic thing. Not everybody is fortunate enough to do that, but if you are, we would love to help you. So with that being said, if you own land, some of the things that you probably don't know, or if you do know, you should get checked out before you come into the uh, offices here. Um, we do have um, what they call perk tests. That if your land doesn't have septic tank and water tap, a perk test has to be done. So with that being said, being a perk test, you would go to your local county, whatever county that you're in, you would go to the environmental health. You would either call in, I think COVID-19 right now has got everybody locked down, but um, you would call in and say, hey, what do I need to do? Where do I need to go to apply for a perk test? Now that is something that you would have to pay for out of pocket just because the dealership cannot afford to pay for everybody's perk test because it may or may not perk. Um, so that is one thing that we always encourage people to go ahead and take care of before you step, you know, come look at houses. If you want to come look at houses before then, that's totally fine as well. So it really doesn't matter, but it really does help you know, you know, if that land will perk. Now, here's the flip side to that. If you already have a land that already has set the tank and re uh, I'm sorry, a septic tank and water tap, say you have an old single wide there that you want to replace, or there's an old farmhouse that got torn down or burned down that you bought the property with. Um, if that is already in the ground, all you have to do then is call the county, environmental health, and get a septic tank reinspect. So basically all they do is they come out and they reinspect the tank, and make sure it's still good, and they tell you yes or no, maybe so, tell you what you need to do to fix it if you need to, and then we can move forward and they give us um, permission to build. Now, with all that being said, if you already own land, of course, it's a little bit easier. But that does not, don't let that discourage you if you don't own land. If you don't own land, we can help you as well. Um, just like with the land, if you already own it, you could either do one or two things. You could do a home only loan or you could do a um, land home. Land home gets you a little bit of better interest rate and a, um, better term most of the time. So with that being said, if you can um, do that and you're willing to tie in your land, then you could get a better interest rate if you do a land home, but a home only loan is acceptable as well. We could do that. It's just a little bit of higher interest rate and a little less term, but people do it every day if they do not want to tie in their land. Now, number two, that means that you do not have land yet or you're on the search, or you have found land, but you haven't purchased it yet. So I'm gonna to try to go through those scenarios fairly quickly. Uh, number one, you don't have land, you could come to us, we could sit down and talk with you, go over different options, get you in contact with a realtor, or we could get you in contact with a website that will work great 
for helping you find land. Uh, of course, you know those websites out there like Zillow and uh, Trulia and all those things that you can search for land on. But old school, just driving around, looking at neighborhoods that you love is always a great idea as well. So number two with that is if you um, have already found a piece of property but just haven't purchased it yet, we could do a land home that way as well. If you wanna purchase it cash, that's great. If you don't have the cash, we can tie in that um, land with a land home package and do, mm, excuse me, and do a mortgage with everything together. So that is, you know, and of course with that property, if it doesn't have a set the tank and water tap on it already, then of course we can tie that into the loan as well. Now, with all that being said, I know that was a lot of information. Um, land is not an issue for us. Um, we can tie it in with the, with the loan and you could finance it in and have it in your payment, or you could pay cash for it and you don't have to worry about financing it in, or you could already own it and we could put a house on there. So this is just a little bit of quick video of helping you understand a little bit more about the land side of a land home package or a modular manufactured home package. So guys, we, we really, really appreciate you listening to our videos. Uh, we do have some really, really exciting stuff coming within the next few weeks. We are going to a factory to film um, some houses so we that are on their spring show their brand new houses never seen before uh, on this channel or anywhere in North Carolina so um, we will be showing those very very soon but if you will give us a big like that will help out our channel phenomenally and give us a click on the notification bell so you can be notified the next time we upload a brand new video also, make sure you hit that big red subscribe button so you could be part of our family, our Downey Tones family. We are, I think, 11,500 people strong now. Um, we, we do have a ton of home videos on our channel. Make sure you click one here or one here. We have a ton of tours that we'd love for you to check out as well. So guys, hang tight. We have more house tours coming, but I do want to integrate videos like this. So leave a comment down below if you like these videos, giving you information about how to get started in the home buying process and how we can help you. So if you like these kind of videos, make sure you leave a comment saying we love it or leave an emoji or something like that saying that you like these types of videos. Um, if you don't like them, then that's fine too. <laughs> so guys, we'll see you next time. And we really thank you for watching uh, Downey's Homes uh, YouTube channel. See you next time, guys.